Bodine delivers code-compliant emergency lighting solutions for today's sophisticated lighting landscape. One of those solutions is our new emergency LED driver, the BSL 10 T3. Before we get started, all work should be performed only by qualified personnel. Follow all safety precautions typical of working with electrical circuits and power tools. Read and follow all precautions given in the Bodine installation instructions. Be sure to remove power from the luminaire during the installation. When installation is complete, power will be re-established and the installation tested. Gather the tools and materials needed for the installation and let's get started. First, open the luminaire and locate the AC wiring, the AC driver, and the LED array wiring. Using the Bodine Emergency LED Driver as a guide, determine where in the luminaire it will be mounted and the location of the test switch. The emergency driver should be mounted in a location with convenient access to the LED array and AC mains wiring and the final location of the test switch. The illuminated test switch should be mounted in a location visible to building occupants and be accessible by maintenance personnel for manual testing. Now, drill or punch holes for the mounting hardware and test switch. The provided test switch requires a half inch hole. For mounting the emergency driver, it may be necessary to pre-drill the mounting holes. Install the emergency driver's test switch in the hole and secure it using the provided nut. Now it's time to make the electrical connections. Locate the appropriate wiring diagram in the installation instructions. Follow it closely and make the connections as shown. Make the connections to the illuminated test switch wires. It may be necessary to use a tool to hold open the connector to accept this thin wire. Locate the LED array positive and negative wires. Disconnect these connections from the LED array. Connect the AC driver's positive and negative output wires to the emergency LED driver's driver in positive and driver in negative terminals. Take the LED array's positive and negative wires and connect them to the emergency LED driver's LED positive and LED negative terminals. Locate the switch and unswitched mains wiring. Connect the ground to the ground terminal, the AC common to the emergency LED driver's neutral terminal, and the unswitched hot to the line terminal. These wires will be run to the location in the luminaire where the AC power connections are to be made. Finally, the BSL 10T3 is installed in the luminaire and you can now test your installation. Reassemble the luminaire and apply AC mains power. The BSL 10T3 shown here is equipped with Bodine's AB Connect which eliminates the need for closing the emergency mode enable connector. Once AC power is applied, the product is ready to go. With the switch and unswitched hot live, the charge indicator LED should be illuminated and the LED array should be powered. When first powered up, the indicator may blink, showing that the product battery is charging. Depressing the test switch should cause the product to enter into the emergency mode. The LED array should remain lit, though may dim slightly. The BSL 10T3 features ST Select which allows for the installer to enable or disable the automatic code compliant testing features of this product. Self-test is enabled by default from the factory, but disabling it is as simple as flipping a switch. If you would like to conduct a full duration test, typically 90 minutes, please allow the emergency driver to remain charging for at least 24 hours prior to testing in order to fully charge the battery. Installation of the BSL 10T3 is now complete. Complete the assembly of the luminaire and, if not already installed, prepare for installation at the job site. There is a wide variety of Bodine emergency products for virtually all applications. Visit our website to see all options. Contact us by phone or email and we can help you find the right product for you. Bodine, delivering code-compliant emergency lighting solutions for today's sophisticated lighting landscape.